Hello Internet, and welcome back to my very first Let's Play ever, Pokemon White. In the last episode, we found our way into Crean City and battled N, where we discovered his plan. Hello, Charon. Please don't challenge me to anything right now. Come with me a sec. Okay. I think there's an item in there. If you go straight from here, there's a Pokemon Center, and use these if you want. Chesto berries. Sorry about that, my dog's bark. <laughs> Sorry about that, as I was saying. My dog's barking and playing in the background. Nice. Oh, hello, N. I want to see things no one can see. The truths of Pokemon inside Pokeballs. The ideals of how trainers should be. And a future where Pokemon have become perfect. Do you feel the same? Yeah. That's so? I think my friends and I should test you to see if you can see this future too. Oh. Well. I'm pretty sure we healed. You have a pit of two. Round two. Let's go. Egg's gonna whoop some ass. Right now, my friends aren't strong enough to save all Pokemon. Maybe I can't solve the equation that will change the world. So I need power. Power enough to make anyone agree with me. Okay there, dude. Now I know what power I need. Reshiram. The legendary Pokemon that, along with the hero, created the Unibur region. It's my turn to become that hero, and you and I will be friends. Does that mean I get Zekrom? Ho 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 ho. Now, let's get on with the video. I am excited to be back playing Pokemon again. Uh, for the past few days, I've been working on some other stuff, like the Siege video. I have another multiplayer video coming up. And I hope you all enjoy it. I hope everyone had a good Christmas, if that's your... If that's what you celebrate. Happy holidays, all of the above. I hope everyone's going to have a good new year. Last we left off, we just spoke with N, I believe. Yeah. We just battled N, and he threatened to go after Reshiram. So I believe we can go meet the gym leader now, right? Or at least her husband. Wow, whenever I look at the skeleton, I'm fascinated. Welcome, I'm Hawes, the assistant director. Since you were kind enough to visit, I'll give you a tour of the museum. The skeleton is a, a dragon type Pokemon. There's a theory that it had an ancient, had an accident while it was flying around the world. And so it became a fossil. It's just a Dragonite, right? This rock is amazing, it's a meteorite. It contains some kind of energy from space. Oh, this? It's an ordinary old stone. It was found near the desert. But other than the fact that it's old, it doesn't seem to have any value. We only display it because it's rather pretty to look at. I feel like a museum should have some sort of significance to each of their objects, right? The Pokemon Gym is just beyond here. At the end of the gym, a very strong and kind gym leader is waiting. By the way, the gym leader Lenora happens to be my wife. happens to be your wife well good for you pal you get to work with your wife like every day gonna take a drink real quick <sighs> a pokemon gym where a leader waits for a challenger at the back of a museum it has a great atmosphere doesn't it so I will give this to you. Or, I will give this to you. 
All trainers in this gym use normal type Pokemon. This is just between you and me. Normal type Pokemon are weak against fighting type Pokemon. Around here, fighting type Pokemon show up around Pinwheel Forest. Now, I will explain about the gym itself. In this Pokemon gym, if you answer questions hidden in books, you can move forward. For your information, the first book is Nice to Meet You, Pokemon. If you don't know where the book is, please ask anyone. Oh yeah, I forgot how kind of annoying this is. Oh, first trainer. I hang around the cream gym all the time. People call me a bookworm. I'll warn you now. I am strong because I spend the entire day either reading books or training Pokemon. You're probably pretty smart, too. But I can't really... I wouldn't say testify. What is the word I'm looking for? I don't know. I can't confirm that. I don't read books much. <laughs> Unless you consider JRPGs books. That... I, I do happen to do a lot. Oh, looks like we need to train a bit. They're already level 17. Uh, yeah. Come on, egg. First trainer in the bag. What level is Bacon Bits? 17. Hmm. Okay. Children's books. Yes. It's a fairy tale about a little boy who met a Pokemon for the first time in his life. He is with a small brown Pokemon. There's a memo between the pages. Pokemon trainers. I am the gym leader, Lenora. I hid four memos in this library. Each of them has a question. Can you solve the questions and come find me? Now, this is the first question. What is the first Pokemon you met in this gym? Patrat? The hint is on a bookshelf in the middle row. I try to find it. Don't be this woman. It's this one, isn't it? Yeah, it's Patrat. They communicate with each other by movement of their tails. A Patrat raises its tail when it sees an enemy. There's a memo on the back cover. As I thought, that question was easy. Well, this is the second question. Flame burns inside its body and it gives off smoke from its head while it runs. What is this book? The hint is somebody may be reading it. I think it's this lady, right? Hmm, I see. Oh, did you find the memo and come here to look for this book? What does the memo say? Flame burns inside its body and it gives off smoke from its head while it runs. I'm reading a book called The Structure of a Locomotive. Is this the correct answer? Yeah, it, locomotive, yeah. That's exactly how a locomotive looks, exactly. Well, I'll let you read this book, but before that, it would be great for my research if we had a Pokemon battle. Ugh. Just get out of my way, lady. I don't got time for this. Hi. Hi, Todd. What are you doing? Sorry, guys. That was my dog. Air cutter. Crit. Your defense does nothing to me. Oh, shit. You might be a problem. Oh. Crit. So this is going to be a problem. But I want Egg to get the XP. So we're going to sacrifice protein for the greater good. Thank God it's not a Nuzlocke. Goodbye, protein. Come on, Bacon Bits. Hey, nice. Perfect. Okay, cool. I'm gonna go heal now. Because holy crap. Yeah, we'll be right back.
Okay. Now we can read the book. This is the bookshelf for general studies. The structure of a locomotive. Yes. There is a memo on the back cover. It's impressive you found this place. That's what I'd expect from a challenger like you. Well, this is the third question. If you heat it up in a pot, it'll be delicious. What is this? Um, the hint is on a bookshelf closer to the entrance than here. There's four questions, right? Have you already found the third memo? Pretty good. So what does the memo say? If you heat it up in a pot, it'll be delicious. What is this? The book I'm reading is about Tepig, but you don't think this book about Tepig is the answer, do you? No. Yeah, I think it's berries or something. Poffins. Okay, yeah. There's a memo on the cover. Did you manage to get here without being tricked by the questions? Now this is the last question. From this bookshelf, move two backward. Move one to the left. Move two forward, move one to the right, and move one backward. What? Now where is it? The hint is, find it by yourself. I'm not. What? I think. What? I don't remember this crap. Yeah, yeah, Poffins. Move two backwards. Two. One to the left. Two forward, one to the right, and move one backward. What the fuck? Two. What? I don't... I know what's under this one. I'm just gonna battle her. I don't... I... Th I'm so confused. I never understood this clue. Just battle me, nerd. Come on, crit. Yes. Boom. Oh, you learn roost this early? That's amazing. Okay, now I'm going to switch you out for bacon bits because bacon bits needs a little bit of a boost before we go in for the gym leader. I think our Pokemon's, what, level 20? So, bacon bits we're gonna have to use for the rest of this battle. Nice. Just get out of my way already, bro. You'll meet the gym leader soon. This is the last book. Now, read the last book. Someone explain to me how this is the answer. It describes the biology of Tepig. Flames burn inside its body and it gives off flames from its nostrils. When it's not well, it can give off only smoke. There's a memo between the pages. You've managed to get here. Well done. You seem to have wisdom as well as strength. I look forward to our battle. Gym leader Lenora. Click. There's a switch under the book. See, I knew it was here. But I'm going to go heal so I don't get slaughtered. <laughs> a hidden passage.
Now we are ready. Baking Bits is going to smack some cheeks. I always instinctively save. Don't judge me. Okay, let's go. Welcome, the director of the Nacreen Museum and the Nacreen's gym leader is me, Lenora. Well then, Challenger, I'm going to research how you battle with the Pokemon you so lovingly raised. All right, come at me, lady. Gosh, does it feel good to play Pokemon again. After playing FPSs and other like multiplayer games, it feels good to play Pokemon again. It's kind of like my natural state, I guess, or a comfort zone. You have Intimid- That bugs me on so many levels. We're gonna see what Salad can do. Oh, stab! Oh, holy shit. Yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and sap some of that HP for when I bring in bacon bits again. Holy shit. That did not go as planned. Whatsoever. See how much an one arm thrust will do. Three. Three times. Okay. Does this mean you're going to use your potion on her? Oh, nope. Okay. Nice! Holy crap, that did half HP, man. Ah, oh, it is 20. Okay, um... We're just gonna try and... Arm thrust you to death. Fuck you and your stupid-ass tactics. Come on, just get four. No, thank God. One. Two. Easy gym badge, boys. Easy gym badge. And that's why we chose Bacon Bits. Smog. What the hell is this? Attack with discharges of filthy gases. It may also poison the target. Bro, get out of here. Give up on smog. We don't need any of that shit. Your fighting style is so enchanting. It is charming. You are a Pokemon trainer worthy of receiving this basic badge. <laughs> Here, basic badge. Nice, second gym badge. If you have two badges, traded Pokemon with level 30, yep. Retaliate. Might use this move later, but it probably doesn't have any. Deer. Deer, come quickly. Team Plasma is threatening to steal some bones. What? What's going on? Tank, you come too. Uh, is everything okay up here? Thanks for the fresh water. Hello? Now you wait. Enough fooling around. Uh, hello. So you've come, gym leader. Ho ho ho. We, Team Plasma, claim this museum's dragon skull in the name of Pokemon Liberation. The hell you do? To show you we're serious, we'll steal it right before your eyes. Well then, here's our smoke screen. How do you just announce a smoke screen. Isn't that, doesn't that go against the whole point of a smoke screen? Or have like all 80s and 90s movies lied to me? What's going on? I don't know. Oh, oh, we have to go after them. Yes, we do. After I heal. <laughs> Lenora? 
Good day, Lenora. Find any good fossils lately? This is a surprise visit. Are you suffering from artist block again? Tank. This is Berg. I almost called him Bugsley. <laughs> he may not look like it, but he's Castellia City's gym leader. And he's gonna get his booty clapped. Eh? Just looking for a change of pace. Seems hectic or something around here. What's up? What's up? Someone just walked away with an exhibit. That's what's up. Uh, hello, Bianca. Just everyone come and join, you know? Oh, hi, Tank. What's everybody doing here? There's Charon. Tank, is there some kind of problem? And these two are your friends? Bianca and Charon. Oh, I see. They're trainers. Okay, then. Let's split up and search. I'll head this way. Everyone, Charon and Bianca, I want you to stay here at the museum. Berg and Tank, you two search Pinwheel Forest. Got it? Berg, you show the way. I'm counting on you, everyone. I mean, it makes sense for you to split us up like that. You go, because you're a powerful gym, you're a powerful Pokemon trainer. You're going to go by yourself. She can trust Berg and I because she just faced me. She knows I'm a powerful trainer. So Berg and I can go up ahead, and then she doesn't know Cher and, and Bianca. So to keep them stationary is probably best. Uh-huh. You are Tank, is it? Are you raring to round up our robbers? Don't alliterate me. Oh, oh, Tank, take this with you. Fennel gave me this dowsing machine to give you. Isn't this the hidden item thing? Now, what did she tell me? Um, you can use the dowsing machine to find places where items are hidden. Yeah, okay. So you can find stuff you can't even see. Cool. For now, all we need to do is protect the museum, right? Yes, Sharon. <laughs> hey, wait for me. Okay, well, I'm going to have to follow up on the story in the next episode because I'm all out of time today. If you're excited to see where our Pokemon journey takes us, subscribe. I strongly suggest checking out some of my other content if you haven't already. But other than that, I'll catch you in the next one. Bye bye <laughs>